it was a dark and stormy night. It um, definitely real street that's not a stock image. It was dark out. Now, me and some of my friends were playing in hide and seek at around on seven o'clock. If I was the seeker and everyone else was hiding. Everyone hid in places like in trees behind bushes. Just behind trees, he's in even, even inside. We did this every year around Halloween. It was hotter than normal out. out. But in my backyard, it was fine. Everyone else. Else, else but he, he went, had already hid, hid before he even counted to twelve. So, I began. I, I descended around. I looked around all of the trees. Each one of them. Them had something. I, I checked the trees, found some kids, and checked bushes they had. We he had caught in everyone except, except there was one kid that and never, never was found. We, he assumed he was, he was playing a trick and was inside. I playing video games, on Xbox. <laughs> Since it was their house, so we went inside, checked the Xbox. No one was there. We went in the basement. No one was there. We went, went upstairs in his room. It was not there. We checked every possible hiding spot, which means means around on their whole yard and perimeter. We asked the next door neighbor. Said he was they hadn't seen him. Seen him since yesterday. Hey, when he did his, his candy route. No check. And then we started to panic. back into the basement and noticed something off. There was the furniture seemed like it was moved around. Oh, revealing a trap door. Which was slightly opened. No one had ever noticed it. So, being kids, not knowing if it was just storage or not, went down. Man of descent. The door sh was slammed shut. Not, no one could get out. Not, hmm, not, as, as it seemed as if it was locked. We were now trapped. Except for you know, the fading light. Single candle light in the middle of the room. There's, there's a TV in the middle. The TV was turned on. It seemed as if, if it was playing Super Mario World. Super Mario. The TV was, was surrounded by blood. The game was running, but the controller was, was not attached. There's, there was a controller. And an SNES, but there was nothing else. We walked up to it. We noticed you, God and Knuckles, was, was chasing Mario. Mario, super duper fast. We couldn't do anything. We plugged in the controller, learned and controlled Mario. Jumped over him, jumping all around. But Ugandan Knuckles, Knuckles kept on saying, "Do you know the way? Do you know the way? Do 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 you know the way?" <laughs> hey, until he finally caught up up with Mario. And hyper realistic blood. <laughs> hyper real. I 
can't do this. T- <laughs> okay, okay. I prefer. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> so hyper <laughs> hyper realistic blood came spewing out of him as you got <laughs> as you got the knuckles <laughs> as you got the knuckles ripped off Mario's head. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, this this joke is getting too far. I might as well just finish the story, but I'm just winging this entire story. Yeah, I'm not even reading any scripts or anything. I'm just making this all up at the spot, not not use, using my intense knowledge. All right, let's keep going. Hyper-realistic blood came spewing out of Mario, as Ugandan Knuckles said. The most fun way, I am inside your home. Finally. SNES. Show. You won't. We came upstairs. It was petrified. It was day at that point. We all decided to go home. And at that point, everyone was still asleep up in their house. When we checked up up in, in his bedroom, there was nothing but a single note. Twenty-five. Alright, I hope you enjoyed that joke. <laughs>